many people outside the country, Western uh, communities, international communities are thinking that Aung San Suu Kyi doesn't have enough power to address the Rohingya uh, problems. In fact, okay, uh, okay, we can understand, that is fine. For example, uh, Aung San Suu Kyi, Ministry of Defense is not under her control. Minister of uh, home, uh, uh, home Affairs is not under her control. Minister of Border Affairs is not under, uh, not under her control. But those three ministers are ministries are responsible, directly responsible to persecute the Rohingya community. But Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Minis Minister of Information uh, is under her, direct under her control. She appointed minister for those ministers. Those two ministers are actively lying or covering all kinds of the crimes uh, committed by the by Myanmar um, armed forces. She has said that the international community is overreacting. What do you make of, of her views? What we are saying instead is international community is, uh, is not speaking enough. The, what international community is revealing and, and saying is tips of the iceberg. If you really want to know the situation, you go to that area, affected area, you can see the, what international community is it, uh, saying is tips of the iceberg. And what more can be done? What do you want the international community to actually do? Two things. One is international community should exercise as many as, uh, as uh, many uh, um, uh, resources as possible should mobilize to, uh, to immediately stop ongoing persecution against the Rohingya. And secondly, the international community should, uh, especially United Nations, should lead an independent investigation team to reveal, to dig out the, all the mass crimes committed by military uh, uh, Myanmar armed forces. Uh, you, um, and, and another thing is to uh, to, to mobilize humanitarian aids uh, urgently needed in, 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 in affected area in north, northern Mongdo and also to Bangladesh.